can see, there's so much beauty to Anna Maria Island. But one of the things that I really enjoy doing is going to the Anna Maria Oyster Bar. But before I take you to the Anna Maria Oyster Bar, I'd like to show you how I started off my day. After Nicole and I set up, we sat back, kicked off our flip-flops, and sank our feet into the deep, white, soft sand of Coquina Beach. You could take a little walk down the beach. You could stop at the Bamboo Beach Bar and Coquina Cafe. Now it's time to jump in this water. You never know what you're gonna find. After a hot day on the beach, we're going to stop here and have a snack at the Anna Maria Oyster Bar. Oh, thank you. Thank you. And this is the view you get from the Anna Maria Oyster Bar. So if you want to come down and have a good meal, sometimes it's also good to come here during happy hour because you get half price off your second appetizer. Now there's a lot of oyster bars in the area. I mean a lot of them. But if you want something unique, you want to be down by the water, this is where you want to go. Right down here, there's a lot of shops down the, down the strip uh, to, ch to check out on Anna Marie Island. And it's just a good vibe. So if you're gonna try an, an oyster bar out, try this one. So I'm just waiting for mom and dad. They were at the beach with us and they're gonna pop in here and have some appetizers with us hopefully. And I think they'll be here soon. Hey, you made it. Ah, got through the traffic, did you? I couldn't wait. I really couldn't. I got my meal. And I'm going to show you what this is. This is this is good. Start off calamari. Mmm. And over here Nicole's squeezing the lemon on the mussels. And Pops, he had fish and chips. Mom's having some chicken quesadilla. So I like I said, if you want to go somewhere really nice, Anna Maria Oyster Bar down here on Anna Maria Island. Come down here. See you later.